BMW Next 100 Year Car, a warm welcome to all my BMW family members. In a split second we literally jump into a time machine. On the occasion of our favorite brand's 100th anniversary, BMW created a marvelous concept car that incorporates the vision of the automotive industry's iconic manufacturer for the next 100 years. So instead of resting on its laurels and looking back at all the beauty that BMW has already contributed to driving pleasure and dazzlingly beautiful four-wheelers, the brand is already looking diligently into the future. We start off by giving you a short preview of what's to come, we answer the questions, what is the similarity between this ultra-futuristic BMW Next 100 and this ancient lizard? What kind of revolutionary breakthroughs can we expect in terms of safety? Safety was not only thought of for the occupants, but also of other road users with whom this supercar comes into contact. We will demystify what BMW means by level 4 autonomy, and how you store the steering wheel if you want the car to do all the work itself. So be sure to keep watching because this and many other gadgets not to be sneezed at will make you proud that you are a BMW fanatic like never before. As usual we start with a joke, after years of suffering from tremendous headaches, Bert finally went to see a doctor. After a lengthy examination, the doctor said, I have good news and bad news. The good news is I have a cure for your headache. The bad news is that your testicles are putting so much pressure on your spine that it causes terrible headaches. All I can do is perform a vasectomy to take that pressure off. Bert was shocked and became depressed and didn't know what to do. A life without sex wasn't very attractive, but with his terrible headaches, he generally didn't feel like it anyway. He decided to get the vasectomy. When he walked out of the hospital after surgery, and was unaffected by headaches for the first time in 20 years, he felt like a completely different person, despite the fact that he was missing something. He was at the beginning of a new life. To celebrate that feeling of new beginnings, he decided to enter a men's store and buy a new suit. When he walked into a gentleman's store, he told the old salesman that he wanted to buy a suit. The guy said, I see you need size 44. Surprised, Bert looked at the salesman and said, laughing, how do you know that? Oh sir, I've been in this business for 40 years and have a very good view of it. Bert tried on a suit and looked in the mirror. The suit fit him like a glove. You have to buy a nice shirt with that, the salesman said. Bert agreed. The old man said, you have size 34 for sleeves and 16 for neck. It's just amazing how you can see that without measuring, Bert said. Oh sir, after 40 years that is really not that difficult. Bert tried on the shirt, and that was also exactly the right size. While we're at it, Bert said, let me see some shoes that go well with this suit. The salesman looked at Bert's feet and said, size 44 isn't it? Bert was again surprised that the salesman could see that without measuring. After trying the shoes, which fit perfectly, the salesperson said, of course you want new underwear too. He looked at Bert's waist for a moment and said, size 36 isn't it? A little triumphant, Bert then said, no, you are wrong this time, I always wear a size 34. The salesman shook his head and said, don't do that. Size 34 is too tight for you and presses your testicles against your spine, which can cause terrible headaches. So guys, if you are true BMW fanatics just like we are and you don't want to miss all the awesome BMW videos that we will be sharing in the future, or you appreciate a good joke and want to support this channel, then hit the subscribe button in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. And also smash the bell for instant notifications. We really appreciate your input, please send us a picture of yourself with your favorite BMW car, we will feature it in one of our next videos and mention you, you can find our email address in the description under this video. Now without further ado, let's dive into the future, meet the embodiment of BMW's future vision for the next 100 years. Whether we will be driving it ourselves or the car will be driving us, BMW is ready to maintain its pole position as a driver of progress. In 2016 this impressive concept car traveled around the world, naturally starting from the cradle in Munich over Los Angeles it went to Beijing and ended her iconic Impulses World Tour in London. The design table for the creation of this BMW of the future rests on the following four legs, 1. As we are used to at BMW, the driver and passengers were put in the center too, 
Artificial Intelligence 3. State of the Art Materials 4. Driving pleasure a first impression is everything, so we start by taking a closer look at the face. Yes indeed, recognizable as never before but still super innovative and sexy if women evolve in the same way in the next 100 years, I will already take an extra sip of my elixir of life. It speaks for itself that the kidney shape has remained, what did you expect? A star, or a bunch of linked circles? Life's not a circus. The raised oriental tinted eyes create a mysterious and cool look. As a perceptive person you already noticed, the wheels are completely encapsulated in the chassis. When you turn the wheel, geometric triangles open and close all around the impressive wheel arches which create the necessary space for maneuver. In addition, an extremely striking red neon light radiates from the open space. This mega ingenious system was dubbed the concept by the Bavarians Alive Geometry. As you will see later in this video, this system creates a whole new dimension in terms of safety, both for the passengers and for other road users, but more on that later. While we are talking about the future, we would like to introduce you to a few fun, future-related statements and questions. The past, present and future walked into a bar it was tense. These days people look forward to the idea of brain transplants becoming possible in the near future. Just wait until we develop the technology they'll definitely change their minds. And one more, past, present and future walk into a bar. Past says, I've ordered a beer. Present says, I'm ordering a beer. Future says, I'll order a beer. As they sip their beers, a girl enters the bar. Past says, I've fucked her. Present says, I'm fucking her. Future says, I'll fuck her. Past says, I had chlamydia. Present says, I have chlamydia. Future says, I'll get. Oh fuck off you guys. Now back to our BMW Future Next 100 car. When we are on the side of the car, you immediately notice that as a gift from the designers, you have 100% privacy hence the car is wrapped all around in gold, only the windscreen has of course been preserved. The four doors open vertically by a slight swing in front of the sensors. What immediately stands out is the extremely spacious interior, you really have a living room feeling when you take a seat in the ergonomic bucket seats that are set in such a way that they can automatically adjust to the physique of the occupants. The center console also takes up barely any space, which benefits engaging in other fun activities while driving. Once more BMW proves to know its customers like no other manufacturer, since they know that we're extremely hands-on and eager to take the bull by the horns, they provided us with a steering wheel that seems to have run away from a Star Trek movie with a sturdy double handle. In a moment we'll take a look at what this futuristic car has in common with an age-old lizard. We also explain what BMW means by level 4 autonomy, and we show how this car thinks along in a super intelligent way to ensure the safety of both the occupants and other road users. But first we do another round of looking into the future. I've once fooled an entire class filled with future doctors, lawyers, and scientists. Of course they were all in kindergarten so it wasn't that hard. Future is shaped by your dreams. So, stop wasting time and go to sleep. A woman wants to know if her three future sons-in-law will be thrustworthy. So she decides to take them one by one on a walk and pretend to slip and fall into the water to see what they will do. And so it goes. On the first walk, she pretends to slip and falls into the water. The first son-in-law takes off his shoes and coat and jumps in the water. The next day there is a new Audi A1 parked in front of the house. There is a letter for the son-in-law which says, Thank you for saving me, here is your new car. Your mother-in-law, the next day the woman tries to do the same walk with her other son-in-law. She again pretends to slip and falls into the water. The second son-in-law immediately jumps after her. The next day there is a new medium-sized Mercedes parked in front of the house. There is a letter for the son-in-law which says, Thank you for saving me, here is your new car. Your mother-in-law, the day after the woman goes again on a walk but with her third son-in-law. Again she slips and falls into the water. The third son-in-law looks left, looks right, and sees nobody. So he continues to walk. The next day there is a brand new BMW M850i convertible parked in front of the house. There is a letter for the son-in-law which says, Thank you for saving me, here is your new car. Your father-in-law. Back to business, what does the BMW Next 100 car have in common with a lizard? 
These built-in triangles in the dashboard aren't ventilation holes for in case someone has eaten too much chili con carne, but as you could already see, there are similar geometric triangles around the wheel arches, these are part of a larger hole called live geometry, outside, triangles connect to those in the dashboard and communicate to the driver what is being detected on the outside of the vehicle. In this way, all potential dangers are immediately nipped in the bud. What does BMW mean by level 4 autonomy? Fact of the matter is that we are inevitably evolving into an era where cars can drive completely autonomously. BMW wouldn't be BMW if they lost sight of their credo, Freude am Fahren, or in plain English, the pleasure of driving, hence they give us the option to either steer ourselves or let us drive, in, autonomous mode, when you have control over the steering wheel yourself, the red neon lights illuminate in the discrete center console at the back of the car, the neon lighting also turns red when you drive, and white in, autonomous mode. If you want to switch from, drive mode, to, autonomous, a simple tap on our favorite logo in the center of the steering wheel will suffice to release the spaceship steering wheel to disappear in the dashboard. We can also state that this car will be powered completely electrically. Listen, a playlist you should definitely check out is our BMW Finest, after watching these short and fun videos you will know all kinds of facts about your favorite car brand and all the legendary cars it has produced so far. At the end of this video it will appear in the center of your screen. All you have to do is click it and you can indulge in more BMW awesomeness. Next time we're going to admire the most beautiful BMW ever made so far. If you don't want to miss out about all the interesting BMW and other videos about the luxury lifestyle that we will be sharing in the future, or you appreciate a good joke and want to support this channel, then hit the subscribe button in the bottom right hand corner of your screen, and also smash the bell for instant notification. Thank you for watching, BMW Next 100 Year Car.